Hi, I'm David with Moxa. I'm going to cover three network design considerations before you purchase a PoE switch for your remote surveillance systems. So, PoE switches are a very popular solution for applications like intelligent transportation or city surveillance, mainly because they reduce the need to run a separate power line to the camera and other power devices, which ultimately save time and money. So, the first thing you need to consider is when it comes to designing your setup for each location, it's important to identify how many devices you want to connect to your switch, but also how many are going to need PoE power. Considering that and thinking about future expansions, you should consider adding additional PoE ports for things like IP cameras or for voice over IP phones or access points. This way you help ensure and future proof your deployment. The second is determine how much bandwidth you're going to need to transmit the data from each site. If you're capturing HD video with a camera, it's going to perform best if you have a gigabit connection on an uplink port to send it back to your control center. And if you have multiple cameras, gigabits are definitely going to be important for your application. So this is going to help make sure that the, the data is transferred without any issues. And the third is how far is your remote site from the control center or your SCADA system? Data can travel through a Ethernet cable for up to 100 meters, but if you're going to be connecting things for longer distances, you should definitely consider using fiber. So, to review, the top three design considerations when integrating PoE to remote surveillance applications are, number one, remember, the number of devices connecting to the PoE switch leaves some spares for your future deployments. Two, the required bandwidth for each location. And three, how far is your remote location from your control center? So feel free to contact us if you have any questions or if you need any help selecting any PoE solutions. And again, thank you for watching.